Hi, first graders. This week in Foundations, we have learned the new concept of vowel consonant E syllables. These words have a silent E at the end of them. This E makes the vowel in the word say its name or have a long sound. Let's review the sound that vowels can make. We know that vowels have both short and long sounds. In class, we worked a lot on short vowel sounds. However, in vowel consonant E syllable words, the vowel makes its long sound or say its name. So, in a vowel consonant E syllable word, instead of A saying A, apple, A, it would say A, safe, A. Instead of E saying E, ed, E, it would say E, peat, E. Instead of I saying I, itch, I, it would say I, pine, I. Instead of O saying O, octopus, A, it would say O, home, O. U can be a little bit trickier because it has two sounds in its long vowel form. It can say U, mule, U, or U, rule, U. We say that E is the busiest letter in the alphabet, but it is silent in vowel consonant E words. It doesn't make a sound. Instead, it makes the vowel say its name or have a long sound. The difference between a closed syllable word and a vowel consonant E syllable word is the silent E and long vowel that a vowel consonant E syllable word has. An example of a closed syllable word is the word hop. This word has a short vowel. When we add a silent E to the end of it, the vowel becomes long. This word then becomes hope. Although these words look similar, they are very different. The same thing happens with the word cap. Cap is a closed syllable word. It has a short vowel. But when we add a silent E to the end of it, the vowel becomes long. This word becomes cape. Cape is a vowel consonant E syllable word. Although similar to cap, it is very different. The silent E makes all the difference. When tapping vowel consonant E words, all sounds receive one tap. The silent E is not heard, so that letter does not receive a tap. So in the word cape, we have three sounds. So three taps are given. Cape would sound like this. K, A, Cape. Hi first graders, in this video we've learned all about vowel consonant E syllables. On the last slide, I taught you how to tap them out. We're going to tap the same word out together now. Tappers up. K, A, P, Cape. We have three sounds because the E is silent, so it gets three taps. K, A, P, Cape. Now we're going to go over how to mark these words together. This word gets marked like this. You have three steps. First, you mark it, you underline the syllable. Cape is one syllable, gets one underline, cape. You mark it as a vowel consonant E syllable. V dash E. You put underneath the line. Then you put a macron, a line on top of the A. Macron is what that's called, on top of the A or your vowel. That symbolizes that the A is a long A. The A says its name. So the macron goes on top of your vowel. Then you slash out the E to show that it is silent. So your three steps again. Underline the syllable, mark it as a vowel consonant E syllable, V dash E. You put a macron on top of your vowel, on top of your A to show that it is long. Then you slash out your E to show that it is silent. I know you all can do this. So your job today is to come up with a vowel consonant E syllable word. Then I want you to mark it and explain how it is marked. I know you all can do this. Have a great day, boys and girls.